Mustafa. I'm from Lebanon. I'm a junior here, and I'm studying electrical engineering. Good. How's it going? <laughs> My name is Jed. I'm a second year student here at DU. I'm studying computer science and biology, and I'm from Damascus, Syria. Eager. <laughs> Such an eager person. I, um, I'm always eager either for the week to end or for the quarter to end or for just something to happen, really. Always looking for the next thing. Yeah, I'd, I'd put it the same way. I'd say motivated. We're kind of hungry right now, but mostly motivated. And that would just be, yeah, to, to just keep going, keep pushing through. <laughs> we should go get food after this. Oh, my home is very, very different from Denver uh, in terms of, you know, what activities you do and just the people in general. However, the weather is pretty similar. We get very cold winters, very hot summers, and just some nice weather in between. Um, I don't, I think, well, I don't know, what do you think, Mustafa? What do you think of the specific? I mean, I'd say people are always smiling here, which is something you don't see where I'm from. Yeah, people, people are, always, are like, super solemn. friendly. Yeah. Yeah. People yeah. are always solemn when you always walk in Always holding the, the door for you, yeah. asking how your day is going, right. talking about the weather, the elevator. Asking what you're doing later, you know, all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. So nice. One eternity later. <laughs> All right, no, I found it. Community. That's what to you is. I'll tell you why. Because like, um, your friends and the people you meet, you get to see them everywhere. You get to hang out with them. You see them in. Uh, and work, uh, what? Show me, show me, show me. Oh, like the atmosphere, like your yeah, like you see work, like atmosphere. work atmosphere, like when you're out there having fun, when you're going out at night, in your classes, and it's always the same people, and so it's always familiar faces, and everyone, since everyone almost knows everyone, they're yeah. always trying to help each other out, um, whenever they see each other, and I think that's great. Yeah, you'll hang out with people that like been friends with for a couple of years and then their best friend will come and be like oh I know these people independently but I don't I didn't know that there was a connection there. exactly yeah and that yeah. happens a lot the reason why I picked Denver University of Denver is because it's in the city of Denver which is a city that is up and coming and uh, I want to be a part of the growth that this city is gonna see in the next uh, 10 hopefully 15 years and just being able to be here at this time, I feel like it's a great opportunity for someone in my age um, doing what I'm currently doing. Yeah, it's it kind of like reflects our personality of young, kind of want to try things, not exactly sure what the direction things are heading in. So yeah, definitely. Denver is full of opportunities, yeah. a lot of opportunities, regardless of what your field is, and that's why a lot of young kids I feel like are coming here too as well. Uh, best part about being a student at DU is all the connections that you get to make through your experience here at DU. I would say just because, yeah, what would you say? No, I mean, like, community seems great, but tying into that, it would probably be that you can find your group, you can find, like, who you're comfortable with, because, it, like, yeah, it, it's a relatively small campus compared to a lot of places, but it's not so small that you're only finding the same thing. Yeah, DU definitely has a very diverse student body, like people who are interested in all sorts of things. Yeah. Um, so you can always find your niche, find people who enjoy the same stuff as you, and just have a great time with them. I would say when we go out to eat, there was always a, so there's always a, this is your food, this is your bill, this is like, that, that's definitely something I'm not really used to. Like where I'm from. Yeah, individualism. Yeah, like right? like where if we go out somewhere back home, like if Jed and I go grab a meal, like we would I, fight over the bill. Yeah, or like if I get the, if I pay for the meal or if he pays for the meal, it's really not that big a deal because <laughs> we're always like hanging out, we're always seeing each other. We might be out here. It's like whatever you get, you pay for. You're responsible for it. You eat. No one touches it. it it's yeah. very different. It really yeah. is. I thought we find uh, Close. authentic fast food. Yeah. If I make any sense, like it tastes exactly like the fast food that we used to get back home. Right. But you don't get a lot of the authentic dishes, and like, right. even if you find 
there's like I think a select few restaurants that are willing to cook these dishes, yeah. but they don't do it as well, and so you don't get to eat a lot of that food here, unfortunately. But Mustafa's a great cook. Yeah, sure. I mean, yeah, I don't need a restaurant when he's around. <laughs> This one of my computer science TAs, Oscar, great dude. He he like not only helped me with computer science, but also helped me with life. He always had like great life lessons and every time I went to meet with him, he's like, Yeah, don't think about this right now. No, no, no. This is and like every time he sees that I'm stressed out about something that's not school related, he would just give me an extension on the assignment. Uh, no, realistically though, I, I do have a favorite professor. Uh, my Cal professor when I first got here, uh, she she like took a personal interest in me because she wanted to make sure that I took classes that would help towards my major. And we've been getting lunch at least once or twice a quarter every like since I've been a freshman. So that's someone that like I feel like I have a friend that's a professor that I can go to if I ever need anything. And I I, I really like, I appreciate it. Yes, it's fast, but. It, it like classes are over quickly so it's a lot of information in a short amount of time but if you don't like the class or if you really like the class you kind of make that decision and then you decide okay now what do I want to do you, you're never lulled into I it's have all too much fun time. and games until winter quarter ends and, and you only have spring one week quarter until spring <laughs> yeah. you're trying to have as much fun as possible during that week that's definitely an issue yeah, yeah. it feels just like a huge uh, semesters from the beginning of winter to the end of spring. It's a whole different thing to focus on. Yourself. Yeah, but we have a very, very, very long winter break. And that's also And great. summer break. Yeah. We got like three months off. Yeah, yeah. So it makes up for it. Yeah. I currently live in Nelson, which is a second year dorm. Uh, my roommate is American. He was my roommate for half of the year last year. And we get along very well. Um, uh, I live in the apartments, they're called the Marie, so uh, I've been living with the same person for two years now, hopefully a third year next year. He's an American student from Idaho, and he's a really, really good friend of mine, we're both in the same major, well, we're in the same, we're both in engineering, he's a mechanical engineer, and I, I genuinely enjoy living. He's someone I get along with. We hang out, we do stuff, but it's never, it's never like I only spend time with him, so I can always get away and do things with other friends. I like to go to concerts as much as possible. I also like to go downtown, go to the city, and just try out new places, new restaurants. Um, what else? Outdoor, just doing outdoorsy stuff like going on hikes, going on long walks, going on. Especially when the weather is really nice out right now. I like going and seeing things around Colorado because like, it's accessible. I've been like, Garden of the Gods a couple of times. Just went and chilled, saw a whole bunch of different things. Uh, saw Boulder, the Springs. I'm going to see the Red Rocks tonight for the first time. Yeah, kind of excited. I personally like to take long walks around here around campus just because we have a lot of parks nearby. So I have a hammock that I just like to throw in my backpack sometimes, walk around, try to set it up whenever, and just take a short nap. Um, I don't read books, but I don't do that. I just look at people who are reading books. Yeah. It calms you. <laughs> it calms me. <laughs> no, I'll usually call someone that I haven't spoken to in a while and catch up. That's always like a nice break yeah. for me to just focus on something else, focus on something I haven't thought about in a while and talk to someone usually what relaxes me, like a chance to not think about what's going on in the moment and just see what other people are up to.